Hey, <clears throat> this is like another video. It's all the clay remakes that I've been made. There's not very many. Let's start off with an actual Gashapon. King Kong. I, I gave him a little bit of a custom paint. He has a red mouth. He actually does have a red mouth. And if you can hear where we had a thunderstorm. <laughs> I still wonder I gave him green eyes. If you can see the green eyes. And his pose is weird, because he can't fight anything. He's just like, hey, I'm King Kong. <laughs> uh, I have a collection update pretty soon after this one, too. Let's start off with ones I added to Pack of Destruction Godzilla 54. This one I really don't care if it goes in the division, it's just gonna be the same color. When it goes in the night vision, it's going to look really cool. It looks like he's charging up for his heat beam. Because in the movie, it was just plain white. Oh, uh, yeah, I forgot to paint part of his arm. Did that big white splotch? Yep. Um, he's not very big. He's only... He measures about two inches. Okay, Burning Godzilla. This one is... The moment of all burning Godzilla's, because he is completely red and you cannot see it. Now that part turns up good, but his spikes are just splotched in red. See? That? <coughs> my blanket on top of my Spongebob one? <coughs> is, uh, red. But it doesn't show up good because it's splotched. Because I remember in the Pack of Destruction, my friend has it, my friend Corwin. <coughs> He only has red fins uh, without the skin implant. Okay, let's start off with one that measures about in not even an inch in scale. It measures about three centimeters. How? It is the Godzilla from Godzilla Raids again. Can you see his buck teeth? They're the same. They're the same color as Godzilla, so probably not. Look, here's, I'll try to stand up one. Here's Burning Godzilla, stand up. Okay, there's Burning Godzilla, or is that, compared to this. This one looks a little more cartoonish than that one does. green with red spikes is made out of play-doh. I know it looks like big there, but he's not all that big. Varen, or Varen. I'm gonna get a bigger one, because I made some actual six inch ones. Well, not six inch. I, I think I made Gorosaurus, you know. I didn't just make that, I made it before. It is painted really crappy, his arm is cracked. His leg fell off. And it's painted extremely crappy. Uh, let's start off with Varen. I think uh, Varen looks better than... So the dash upon self that's basically just falling apart. This is the other one. This is the newer one. I prefer the newer one over this one. Because his spikes on the plates on his back are just falling off. Not that I wanted him to do that. Oh, and here's a quick glimpse at the bigger ones. Mecha Godzilla. Gorosaurus. Godzilla 84. And Mothra. Anyway, back to this review. Last but not least, Baragon. This is like the first one I made. Like I said, he is red, not pink. See? My blanket is red and it still shows up that color. Yeah, um, I still have a little bit of time left. Because up here it actually says the time, like, Ooh, 5, 44 or something. Uh, orange eyes, orange horn, just a plain red body. I'm gonna give you my favorite moment in the video. 
I was watching Godzilla's uh, 50th anniversary memorial box, Godzilla 2000 video, and he said, the band that creation one looks cartoonish. Example, Spongebob, My Neighbor Totoro. I've seen both of those. I've pretty much seen all the Spongebob episodes that I've seen My Neighbor Totoro. It's actually kind of a good movie if you look at it. Anyway, this actually came in an animal set, and I just thought it looked just like King Kong. It came with a zoo set when I was in the animals. But now my new fashion is Godzilla, and I make some movie posters. These are the old ones. Godzilla 2000, over there. Oh. 1954. Uh, I gotta stop, never mind. Please subscribe, and comment, and rate, and like, and don't